Hey folks, welcome back. We're here for you again and bringing the coolest vibes of NBA for you all. You are watching the series of the players' unknown facts being disclosed up to you all. And nothing beats the rejoice of knowing the amazing facts and figures of your favorite players. This time we are here with the Anthony Melton. De'Anthony Melton has been one of the Memphis Grizzlies' most impactful players this season, since permanently joining the rotation on December 9th. The Grizzlies are 26-17, playing at the pace of a 50-win team, 60.5 winning percentage. The Grizzlies are also 11.1 .1 points better with Melton on the floor than off it, per cleaning the glass. When looking at the top Grizzly trios that played 200 or more minutes together, Melton is in the top four. Let's move forward with our video and have a look at the top 10 things you didn't know about the Anthony Melton. So, let's begin. But before we proceed further, if you haven't yet subscribed to the channel, do hit the subscribe button so that you won't be missing out on any future NBA content. Number 10 birth and moving forward. Born on May 28, 1998, DeAnthony Melton is an American professional basketball player for the Memphis Grizzlies of the National Basketball Association. He was selected by the Houston Rockets in the second round of the 2018 NBA Draft with the 46th pick but was traded to Phoenix before his rookie season began. He played college basketball for the USC Trojans of the Pac-12 Conference, but did not play in the 2017-18 season due to the events relating to the 2017-18 NCAA Division I men's basketball corruption scandal. Number 9 The High School and Career to College Melton attended Crespi Carmelite High School in Encino, California as a freestar recruit. He committed to the USC Trojans on November 20, 2015. Melton played in 36 games, starting in the last 25 games of the season that year. He averaged 8.3 points, 3.5 assists, 4.7 rebounds and 1.9 steals per game. Melton became the first freshman to record at least 300 points, 150 rebounds, 100 assists, 60 steals and 35 blocks in their starting season since Dwayne Wade. As a result of those stats, he was projected to be a key player for USC's upcoming season. Due to the charges carried out, USC indefinitely suspended Melton in relation to the scandal due to a family member's involvement there. On February 21, 2018, Melton announced he would withdraw from USC and declare for the 2018 NBA Draft. Number 8 Moving to NBA Melton was selected with the 46th pick by the Houston Rockets in the 2018 NBA Draft. He played for the Rockets during the 2018 NBA Summer League in Las Vegas. In five games, Melton recorded 16.4 points, 7.2 rebounds, 4.0 assists and 3 steals per game. Melton was then traded to the Phoenix Suns. Melton shined on the defensive end of the court as well as put his playmaking skills on display in the Suns' victory against the Sacramento Kings on January 8th. Melton scored 10 points with 8 assists, 4 rebounds, 4 steals and 2 blocks in the win. Melton was second in the NBA in rookie steals in 2018-19 with 1.36 steals per game. When Melton is on the floor, he recorded steals more frequently than any other player in the NBA, ranking first with 3.3 steals per 100 possessions. Among rookies to start in majority of their appearances, Melton's 3.3 steals per 100 possessions are tied for sixth most all-time in the Basketball References database. On July 7, 2019, the Suns traded Melton and two second-round picks to the Memphis Grizzlies. Number 7 Abnormally Physical Melton doesn't need to be a superstar, he needs to be a defensive-minded combo guard that hits a free every once in a while, haunts opposing guards' dreams on the perimeter and lives on the glass. An anomaly physically, Melton has long arms that allow him to cut off passing lanes and get to angles most defenders can't. If you need a player that doesn't care about ego and only winning, Melton is your guy. He rarely makes mistakes when it matters and developing into an important closer for Jenkins. He can be a complementary piece going forward that can serve as the fourth, fifth best option on a title contending team. 
Alongside Ja Morant, he can serve as the lockdown perimeter defender that becomes the Clay Thompson to Steph Curry on that end of the floor. Well, that's a shocking bit of information. Number 6. Kleiman Monster Melton is the ultimate modern glue guy, and to your point, Melton is definitely a combination of different players. Perhaps he really is Kleiman's monster. His game is difficult to compare, everyone's favorite sports analytical exercise. He has a higher rebounding rate than Ben Simmons, a higher steal rate than Jimmy Butler, and a higher assist rate than Donovan Mitchell. It's quite fascinating observation. Is there any sort of comparison to make for him? The popular one is Avery Bradley, but Melton's numbers are superior to Bradley's year two numbers across the board. The young player sure got some guts in him. Things keep getting interesting. Keep yourself tuned in as we discover five more amazing facts with you all. Hope you guys are enjoying the video and if you have not yet subscribed to the channel, do it now in order to make sure that you don't miss out on any future NBA content from now on. Number five. Elite Glue Guy As the numbers have shown, he is on par with their development and is showing signs of being an elite glue guy. Melton's advanced numbers are so weird that we have to reach a little to really dive into his game. One of the most encouraging parts of my risky, overly optimistic deep dive into Melton is that he is doing all of this while averaging only 17 minutes per game. The average NBA player is sitting at 15. Melton's is 18.2. Numbers never lie, right? Look at the box score of any Grizz game since December 9th and I guarantee his plus-minus is in the positive or close to it. He's a quiet yet important part of every win. Another similarity to Kawi and Drew. Glue guys don't need the glory, they care about wins. Melton's stats will absolutely increase with time, which means his production and impact will only continue to improve. Number 4 key find for the Grizzlies. Melton, a 21-year-old 6'2 guard with a 6'8 wingspan, was acquired in the Josh Jackson trade. Melton, a former second-round pick who barely played as a rookie, has been the real coup. In 30 games, his traditional numbers are overall solid, but he stands out in ways that are particularly useful around players like Morant and Jackson Jr. While being fifth on the team in usage rate, he's posting an assist to usage rate of 1.04 in the 67th percentile of combo guards, per cleaning the glass. His turnover rate is a bit high, but he's still young and really in his full season. That should drop over time, and on defense, he's already a good defender with steal and block percentages in the 93rd percentile for his position. He's also rebounding at a high level for his position. Number 3 about that grit and grind. De'Anthony Melton has found himself at the back of the bench with the Grizzlies with more DMPs than playing time, plus multiple Memphis hustle assignments. But Melton has the ability to make an impact on both ends of the floor, and all he needed was minutes to prove it. Melton's performance has won his coach over and the fans alike. He also has been outplaying Tyus Jones, who was inserted into the starting lineup with Morant sidelined. The 21-year-old says he has learnt a lot from Jackson and Morant. He says they have both taught him how to handle different situations, especially being young focal points and also being able to be successful with it. Melton says being in Memphis just teaches you to be scrappy, and every night our team preaches the grit and grind and to compete no matter what. In just two games, Melton had proven he deserves a spot in the rotation. He has been making his presence felt on both ends of the floor. Number 2 Big Brother on the Team Melton's versatility has led to him being offered by San Francisco, but more offers will likely follow. He said that Rice, St. Louis and UC Santa Barbara have also looked at him. In the interim, Melton is comfortable using his versatility and experience to serve as a big brother on the team. With four freshmen and several sophomores playing key minutes, his teammates look to him and senior Mike Kakayan for leadership and both have helped make their younger mates better on the court. Melton's easygoing presence helps when he's offering instruction because of being harsh, he softens his advice with encouragement. And number one, building momentum. 
Compared to other additions the Memphis Grizzlies made this summer, the Anthony Melton was being described as a lottery ticket to take a chance on. Melton has not just been present when he has seen the court, he has made his presence felt. Melton has been nothing short of a revelation. Among NBA sophomores who have played more than 400 minutes this season, Melton is one of only five players who rank in the top 10 of PER, win shares per 48 minutes, box plus slash minus, and value over a replacement player. While it may be debated how much value should be placed on these statistical categories, they collectively prove that Melton has been extremely valuable. In terms of his individual skill set, Melton does not stand out as many other players do. He does not score, pass or rebound as one of the best in the game. However, he is a stats sheet stuffer as he has a variety of ways to contribute when on the court. Melton is one of only two players, along with DeJounte Murray of the San Antonio Spurs, who have played more than 430 minutes in the NBA this season and produced per 36-minute averages of 15 or more points, 8 or more rebounds, 6 or more assists and 2.5 or more steals. The significance of these numbers proves that Melton's all-around game can add positive value in a variety of ways on both ends of the court. Hope you guys have enjoyed the video and thumbs up if you've liked it and do hit that subscribe button so that you won't be missing out on any interesting videos from now on.